Oh, comic book fans, my nerdy friends, and my geeky compadres, what's going on? It's Friday, and I am now headed to my local comic shop. About to pick up a bunch of books. Um, really bummed that I couldn't go out on Wednesday and get them, but, you know, later's better than nothing. So, um, heading there right now, I'm on my lunch break from work, and I will finally pick up my books, and I'll be back with you momentarily. All right, guys, here we go. Here's the two-day late haul, but start off with Polarity number three. Totally psyched about this book. It really sucks that it's a four-parter, but um, totally stoked on it. It's such a good freaking book. Um, amazing, and yeah, just awesome. Next, we got The Return of Bedlam. This is Bedlam number seven um, after a couple month break uh we got somebody new on art we got ryan brown on art instead of rossmo um it looks pretty similar so i'm really happy about that just flipping through it um you know i don't know if there's any like flashback scenes or anything like that uh with matter red but really really happy that the art didn't change all that much with the artist uh swap on it and next East of West, number three. I know a lot of people are dropping this. Um, you know, sucks to be you guys, I guess. Um, I really liked... I really liked one and two. And these covers are awesome. Yeah, I like it. Uh, next, after that, is The Colonized, number three. Another miniseries that I wish would just keep going. Uh, it's just been awesome. You know, um... I can't say anything else. It's just been super sweet. If you haven't picked it up, you know, maybe I'll wait for it to come out and trade if it comes out and trade. Uh, but it's totally awesome. Uh, next after that, we got Avengers Arena. This is number 10. Really loving this book. I know a lot of people dropped it. You know, um, around issue three or four. But I'm really, really liking it. Uh, after that, I got... Green Lantern number 21 decided this was the point I wanted to jump in on and I'm even wearing my Green Lantern shirt today I don't know if you can see it, but it says chicks dig the bling Green Lantern on the front had to wear it because I knew I was picking it up next Superior spider-man this continues to be an awesome awesome book um, I'm really enjoying it. You know uh, Stegman's not on art in this one, but you know It'll still be good uh, Dan Slott's doing an awesome job on the story there. After that, we got Swamp Thing. Pick this book up. I, start, I jumped on this book maybe like three months ago, uh, thanks to Nate, and I'm loving it. So, really stoked to see what, uh, what transpires, because um, it's a sweet book. Suicide Risk number two. Uh, the first issue was last month, and it blew me away. Can't wait to see what happens after the huge lightning bolt hit the main character there. Uh, he's supposed to be getting his power, and we're going to see what it is, I guess. After that, uh, this next book, I picked up the first one. I wasn't entirely overly impressed with it, um, but I talked to uh, the Hulk's big toe, and, you know, because he's such a top bloke, okay? I decided to pick up 10 grand. So, cheers, mate. Thanks a lot. We'll see how that turns out. Uh, after that, Thanos Rising, number three. Uh, this book is fantastic. Uh, giving you, like, the origin story of Thanos. And it's just been great so far. So, you know, yeah, I'm totally psyched to read this. I just can't wait. And last but not least, we got Uber, number two see how this turns out um you know i i liked number one but it didn't like wow me completely uh so we'll see what happens uh with this one you know i 
usually gives things about three issues before I drop them completely. So, uh, that being number two, uh, it's got one more to wow me. Uh, so, what else to talk about? I don't think I really have much, but that was my haul for the week. Finally, um, you know, uh, thanks for watching. Go check out the Hulk's Big Toe. His channel is awesome. Uh, great guy. And um, I guess I'll see you guys later. Have a good one.